All right, guys, we got a fun one today. So last week, if you missed our video, we did a video all about the best smelling types of firewood. We'll put a link to that here so you can go and watch it if you haven't seen it yet. And this week, we're gonna be talking about some of the worst smelling types of firewood. And so if you've ever had a campfire and it just smells terrible, like it's just like, it smells like something like roadkill or something like a skunk or something like that, then you might've burned one of these types of firewood. So there's four in particular that we're gonna talk about and uh, that's what we're gonna jump into here. If you find this type of thing interesting, you like talking about firewood and the outdoors, then I encourage you to subscribe to this channel. This is the type of video we post, so this is what you can expect from us. With that, let's jump in. So number one is Buckeye. Buckeye is a pretty common tree here in the Midwest US where I am, and uh, if you are, are in the area, you might know what I'm talking about, or perhaps if you are an Ohio State fan, you'll recognize the name. It's a fairly common type of tree in some areas, and uh, it is a, a pretty bad firewood in addition to having a bad smell, but if you do find some and you end up burning it, the smell that you can expect from it could be described as something uh, on the, the spectrum of roadkill or skunk. So neither of which are good, so it might be best to avoid it if you can do that. Number two is an invasive species here in, the, in, in North America. It's originally from Asia, and it's Alanthus. You may have seen Alanthus trees. Um, they do grow quite a bit in some areas in North America. Um, but it's not good for sort of the native trees. It kind of can take up some of the habitat and cause some problems. Uh, but it also happens to be a pretty bad firewood and it has a pretty bad smell. As far as the smell goes, what to compare it to, it is pretty similar to Buckeye. It sort of has that roadkill, like nasty, sort of just gross, I don't know how to ex else to describe it, sort of dead, gross, decaying smell. It's not good, so it's not good for campfires and burning outside especially. Firewood number three is maybe a little bit unfair in calling it a bad smelling firewood because it isn't inherently bad smelling. It only smells bad if it's growing next to something or in something that has a bad smell. And so that type of firewood, I actually have a piece right here. Uh, it's this guy right here, and this is elm. So elm doesn't inherently smell bad, but if you have an, oak, uh, an elm tree that has fallen down or if you've cut down an elm tree and you plan to use it for firewood, take a moment to think about where it's growing because if it's growing next to something like, say, a septic line, then uh, your fire, your campfire is going to smell, well, like a septic line, which, as you can imagine, uh, smells like crap. <laughs> no, no pun intended. <laughs> it's just going to smell bad. And then firewood number four that's going to kind of round out this list of bad smelling firewoods is pretty similar to elm in that it's not inherently bad smelling, but it does tend to absorb the smell of whatever it's growing in or next to, and that is silver maple. Um, and so if you've got a lot of silver maple trees, um, it's, it's fairly common in some areas, so if you have a lot of silver maple trees and you plan to use some of it for firewood, it might pay to pay attention to where it's growing, especially if you plan to burn that outside for something like a campfire like I've got here, um, because if it is growing next to something that smells terrible, then it's probably gonna pick up that smell and uh, it's gonna be unpleasant for you to be standing around. So those are four bad smelling firewoods. If you think that I've missed one or if you can think of one that I haven't named here that has a really bad smell, leave it in the comments for me. I'd love to hear what you have to say. And uh, if you found this interesting, like this kind of chat around the campfire about bad smelling wood, then hit the like button for us and we'll look forward to seeing you in our next video. Bye guys.